I feel the blood creeping up from the heathens. God will, God fight, God. All right, guys. Um, I highly welcome to my channel once again today. Real quick, guys. Um, today I am going to share with you guys another powerful strategy that you guys are going to use to trade Boom 300 index and crash 300 index. All right, pay very close attention, guys, while I walk you through how this strategy works. All right, so this is very, very powerful. This is very, very accurate, guys. So, um, this particular strategy that we are talking about today is almost 100% accurate. All right, so I can rate it or I can categorically rate this strategy 99.9% .9 accurate, guys. So for you to know the um the percentage of the accuracy of this strategy, guys, you will understand what I'm talking about right now. So um this particular strategy that we are talking about, that I'm talking about right now, I am going to sh share these settings with you guys so that you'll be able to set your screen this way and also um mind you before you start setting up anything here i want you to first of all analyze your chart as usual all right i normally say this if you want to start trading any of these pairs make sure you analyze from higher time frame to your lower time frame so already i've done that here because of time i i wouldn't want um us to take much of our time here so that is why i've already analyzed this market from higher time frame and uh, this is five minute time frame as you can see here and this is boom 300 index all right so this is five minutes time frame so i'm just trying to round it up here on five minutes time frame this is how to trade boom 300 index profitably and successfully without the fear of probably spike or whatsoever all right so now if you want to trade boom 300 traditionally this strategy is going to walk you through on how to do that profitably without any loss all right so if you follow my instructions properly there is no way you are going to encounter any loss and if you want to be catching spikes as well this strategy also will walk you through on how to do that profitably and successfully without any loss if you follow my instructions properly. Now, before you set up this, as I said earlier on, make sure you have analyzed your chart this way from higher time frame and mark all the necessary zone that you really need to be um to mark all these things that you are seeing here. All these things are the markings that I've given to this um particular uh chart here so when you look at this now let's take for instance um when you look at this from this particular zone that serves as um support uh, resistance here you will see that this market rejected one two three four here and the market moved down to this particular one that serves as support here all right so as you look at this here you will see one two here the rejection and the market move back up when you get to the same zone not it is not necessarily that it will be moving this way all right just try as much as possible to you know come down study the chart and understand this thing i'm telling you because without you knowing all this and there is no way you are going to make profit from the market all right without all these things that i'm telling you this accurate strategy is not going to profit you all right so you just need to understand this particular chart pattern and the structure of this chart chart before you'll be able to make use of this indicator and it will be very very profitable for you guys all right so i would like every one of you that are watching this video right now to give me a positive um you know um response by showing me the screenshot of what you um or the profit that you made from this particular strategy because this is very very accurate i've been using this strategy to kill it on boom 300 and uh, i just felt like this is the best time for me to share this strategy so that most of you or all of you out there will be able to use it and start making real cash immediately. All right. So this is how it works, guys. When you look at these things that I was analyzing here, when you look at my indicator window one or this strategy here, this indicator window one, you will see that as soon as based on I have analyzed this particular trend or this particular uh, chart and I, I draw i've plotted out this before this is all uh, this move, market movement here probably i've plotted all these things all right so as soon as this rejection happened that is to say i'll be getting ready to sell i will be getting ready to follow the normal default movement of a uh, boom all right so now i now spot one two three four 
rejection here and as soon as I, I saw I spot that this market is coming down and when I trace this particular market at uh, this rejection you will see these are the rejections all right these are the rejects all these rejected zone here these are the rejections here you can see that here so as soon as this market start coming down here you will see that when you look at this indicator window one you will see that this particular place that you are seeing here probably let me use this horizontal line to mark it so that you understand okay perfect now when you look at this that place that i marked you will see that that place serves as zero level of this uh, indicator window one all right it serves as zero level so whenever this histogram is above this zero line that is to say the market will continue buying so you can only sell whenever this uh, histogram is below this zero line all right so let me come again whenever this histogram is above this zero line you are entitled to buy that is you are catching spikes now all right so whenever the histogram is below this zero line you are selling normally as uh, per default movement of the boom you are selling then now let's use because of uh, let's use the example of what we just analyzed right now and uh, you know round up what we are saying here as soon as this market rejected at this zone you will be looking at this place here all right all this rejection that you might probably you were here and you saw the first rejection this two double top here and you look at this zone and already as soon as you spot this two double top most of us will jump into trade which is normal because it has already rejected at this resistance zone here but this indicator this almost 100 percent uh, accurate indicator will tell you hold on now for you to sell based on you have seen triple or double rejection here for you to stay here this particular histogram must be below zero level so if you if you didn't see this histogram below this zero level here and you want to say stay clear from that market don't say don't open any position this is the best time for you to sell when you look at this the histogram will, will also give you the um direction now when you look at all these things all these things for me it's the all these things are like fake out to me all right when you look at this histogram histogram is like pointing it out that these are fake outs all right so it will only allow you to open a position when you saw or when you see that look at this here as soon as this histogram um crosses from this above zero level to below zero level here you can see the histogram has crossed from above to below look at it here from up to down all right look at the histogram here as soon as you spot this first uh, bar of the histogram below the zero level and you uh, cross check it here on the main chart and you, you can see this is where you are supposed to open that your position you can see that here let's use um another vertical line this is where you are supposed to open that your position that is it all right that is where you are supposed to open that position so you pick one two at least this is uh boom 300 as i said earlier and it's very very volatile it's very very fast so for you to be uh, in to be in on uh, in on this particular trade for 10 minutes that is each of the candlestick here represents uh five minutes and if you take one two candles that is to say you have been you are uh, you, you are in this market for uh 10 good minutes so do you know how much you might have made from that from this particular market under 10 minutes with uh, boom 300 all right because boom 300 does not move the way normal boom uh, 500 boom 1000 moves is very very fast it's very very volatile so you can make a lot of money trading this you can build any account with this thing that i'm telling you with this particular strategy that i'm sharing with you guys here so that is exactly the way you can go about all these things make sure you plot all these things as you can see the current market here when you look at the current market here this is the current uh market here and look at it here all right so now if we want to know whether we are going to 
or buy or sell now first of all we have to wait for this market if this market breaks this particular structure this particular line support here all right if it breaks this support and this particular histogram is still below this zero level that is to say it will continue going down probably to any of this level here probably um to this level um to this level first secondly to this particular one here all right so once she breaks this particular place and another candle open below this and retest on this and start coming down and this histogram is still below this place this uh, zero level you open your position here your first tp should be at this particular zone here as simple as that guys that is very very simple for you to trade and make money all right there is no way or there is no any other way or any other uh, strategy out there that we put or uh, put you through on how to trade boom 300 index this way all right this is almost 100 percent accurate strategy i've been using this strategy guys so i just felt just as i said earlier on i just decided to share this strategy so that you guys will start using it to make recash re cash after watching this video all right so that is it guys if you love content like this and you want to be getting content like this what you just need to do for yourself is this make sure you smash that like button subscribe to this channel and turn on your notification bell so that whenever i upload or share content like this you will be among the first that youtube is going to notify that i've uploaded or i have shared another powerful content like this that will help you assist you to trade boom and crash all right so that is it and also um if you want me to mentor you on how to be trading um these synthetic indices as well i am going to leave my whatsapp number in the description of this video what you just need to do is add me on whatsapp and send me a message you know or uh, let me know that you want me to mentor you on how to trade synthetic indices and we we'll definitely get back to you as soon as i receive your message and also um I am now open to um, investment. All right, there is a great difference between investment and managing of account. All right, so I am open to investment right now. And if you want, um, you want to invest or you want to, you know, go into investment, also uh, contact me via the number that will be in the description of this uh, video and i will also get back to you just specify that you want me or you want to invest all right it's as simple as that and i will um get back to you on that and we can discuss the terms all right also i am going to leave the link to my books in the description of this video most of um most of you that does not have money to enroll yourself on mentorship program it is very very um advisable for you to you know pick any of the books and go through it especially um in fact pick the books and go through it and uh, i believe that book will uh, walk you through on how to you know uh, trade boom and crash and the particular strategy that you need to be uh, using when trading boom and crash so that is it guys all right let me share um with you guys the settings so that you'll be able to set your screen this way all right so um this is where you add indicators to your chart all right once you click on this particular place uh, what you just need to do once you click on it this way just first indicator that you're going to add um type rsi all right once you type rsi you click on it then you close it here all right you close it i'm not going to do that now because i, I already have uh, rsi installed on my chart so um this is the rsi here the yellow line that you can see here this is the rsi so let me open it so that you will see the settings now the input should be um that is the length should be 17 all right then you go to style here take screenshot of what you are seeing here if you cannot see it properly just take screenshot zoom your distance very well as you can see you zoom it very well then um, you you set your screen this way at this particular place here make sure you set this place to um 82 18 all right so that is it after setting that then uh, you click okay all right you click okay this is how your chart is going to be all right look at these two yellow line that you are seeing up and down that is our rsi all 
all right so now the second one that you are going to add you come back to this particular indicators here once you click on it you type um go to the search bar and type cci and then look at it here the second one here is called commodity channel index all right commodity channel index you click on it once then you close it it will appear in your chart here once you have it appear on your chart then uh, probably it will not appear on your chart this way all right it's going to um, have separate window then right click inside that particular one just like this right click on it this way you will see um if it appears up or down just click on merge up or merge down all right so that is how it's going to go inside um your rsi so the settings of the the um cci let me open it so that you will see the settings you go to the first one that you are going to set up should be the length which is 21 and uh, you go to style here when you come to style here look at this here you are just going to change this particular one here all right this particular place that you are seeing here yours will be online all right so select or change it to histogram that is it after doing that just click on ok and this that is what you are going to see or this is how your chart is going to look like make sure those um settings are correct all right so after doing that you click okay you click okay and that is it you are good to go all right you are good to go so that is it guys um signing out only test peace